A very wise woman once said, huh. In my spare time, I often peruse the online GMRS forums to see what the experts are up to and to see what kind of questions the normal people are asking. And a question that I see coming up often is, can my brand XYZ GMRS radio talk to my friend's brand blah, 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 something else radio. Are all GMRS radio channels the same and are all GMRS radios compatible? And many times I have witnessed with my own very own eyes, the experts leaving comments, replying to the normal people. No, GMRS channels are not standardized and that one manufacturer of one GMRS radio may use different frequencies than another manufacturer. But of course, when the experts, experts say that, it takes them 10 paragraphs to say what I just said in one or two sentences. And of course, that paragraph always starts off with, I've been a ham radio operator since 1982. Although I still don't understand what being a ham radio operator has to do with GMRS. But I guess, how else would we know they were experts? Anyway, the GMRS experts are saying for eSample, that a radio using channel 19, the official GMRS road and travel channel, radio on channel 19 made by one manufacturer cannot or may not talk to a radio, a GMRS radio on channel 19 made by another manufacturer. What they're saying is that not all GMRS radios are compatible and this is not really correct. Allow me to clarify. Now this can be a very confusing subject so allow me to explain it slowly so that even the experts sitting in their basement can follow along. For simplicity, I will begin with the short version. The channels on every FCC Part 95E compliant GMRS radio manufactured since the year 2017 are the same. And most radios manufactured before the year 2017 also use the same frequencies and same channel scheme. That means that channel 19 on this Wuxin Ocean GMRS radio is the same channel 19 as on this 50 watt Midland mobile radio. Now, some mobile GMRS radios cannot transmit on GMRS channels 8 through 14, for example, this one. And some GMRS radios may come pre-programmed with CTCSS tones on them or privacy tones, meaning you may not hear other radios unless they're using the same tones, but they're all still using the same frequency. Channel 19 on this radio is still and always the same channel 19 as on this radio from another brand. In short, all GMRS radios manufactured since the year 2017 are compatible. If that's all you wanted to know, thank you for watching. You're excused. But if you wish to enrich your life and learn more and find out where I came up with my information, stick around for another minute or two and all will be elucidated. In these United States, to have the word GMRS on the box of a radio, it must first be FCC type approved or certified by the FCC. And the FCC spells out very clearly what a radio can do and cannot do, what frequencies it can use, and what channels it must label or name those frequencies. You can find all of this information for yourself in the FCC document named Guidance for Certification of Part 95 GMRS and FRS Transmitting Equipment. I'll put it on the screen so the experts can read it. In that document, the channel numbers and the frequencies assigned to those channel numbers are very clearly laid out. And if the manufacturer does not follow that guideline, they will not be certified or allowed to sell that radio as a GMRS radio in the United States. So yes, Virginia, all GMRS radios manufactured and sold in the United States since 2017 all use the same channels and the same frequencies and can all talk to each other.
If you know of an example of a GMRS radio manufactured after the year 2017 and sold in the United States as a GMRS radio that is not using the standard 22 channels, leave the brand and model number below.